Well, good morning and welcome to worship. My name is Pastor Chrissy Salser and I serve here at Servants United Parish. Servants United Parish is a geographic parish uh, cooperating in God's name. We have churches in uh, Dwight, Cornell, Shenoa, Anchor, Sibley, Gibson City. We are glad you could join us today. We invite you to check out us on our website at ServantsUnitedParish.org or check us out on Facebook for upcoming events. Both myself and Pastor Jim Reeves are available for pastoral care if there's anything we can do to support you. the Holy Trinity, one God, the God of manna, the God of miracles, the God of mercy. Amen. Drawn to Christ and seeking God's abundance, let us confess our sin. God, our provider, help us. It is hard to believe there is enough to share. We question your ways, then they differ from the ways of the world in which we live. We turn to our own understanding rather than trusting in you. We take offense at your teachings and your ways. Turn us again to you. Where else can we turn? Share with us the words of eternal life and feed us for life in this world. Beloved people of God, in Jesus, the manna from heaven, we are fed and nourished. By Jesus, the worker of miracles, there is more than enough, always. Through Jesus, the bread of life, we are shown God's mercy. We are forgiven and we are loved in abundant life. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you, and also with you. Let us pray. Gracious God, you have placed within the hearts of all your children a longing for your word and a hunger for your truth. Grant that we may know your Son to be the true bread of heaven, and share this bread with all the world. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. The Holy Gospel according to St. John, the sixth chapter, this gospel will serve as a text for our sermon today. Jesus went to the other side of the Sea of Galilee, also called the Sea of Tiberias. A large crowd kept following him because they saw the signs that he was doing. Jesus went up the mountain and sat down there with his disciples. Now the Passover, the festival of the Jews, was near. When he saw a large crowd coming toward him, he said to Philip, where are we to find bread enough for these people to eat? He said this to test them because he himself knew what he was going to do. Philip answered him, six months' wages would not be enough to buy enough for these people to eat. One of his disciples, Andrew, Simon Peter's brother, said to him, There is a boy here who has five barley loaves and two fish, but what are they among so many people? Jesus said, Make the people sit down. Now there was a great deal of grass in the place, so the people sat down, about 5,000 in all. Jesus took the loaves, and when he had given thanks, he distributed them uh, to those who were seated, so also the fish as much as they wanted. When they were satisfied, he said uh, to them, Gather up the fragments left over so that nothing may be lost. So they gathered them up. And from the fragments of the five barley loaves left by those who had eaten, they filled twelve baskets. When the people saw the sign that he had done, they began to say, This is indeed a prophet who has come into our world. The Gospel of the Lord. <laughs> 